Alright, welcome back guys to another brand new video and today I will be showing you guys how to make a, a realistic lighting, kind of, like this, because uh, because uh, some people don't know because they have smooth brains, and uh, yeah, so uh, <coughs> you want to first select your directional light, it will be over here in the very beginning, select it. Put it to, I recommend just keeping it on real time. It looks better with the shadows. And yes, you can still bake it on real time. Turn on uh, soft shadows. Bias all the way up, normal bias all the way down. And a near plane, I don't know. I don't know which one to recommend. That That's just like, I just keep it all the way up for no reason. Anyway, I'm in the winter, so mine is gray. Just forget about that. So go into window if you don't have it. Click search, new window. And type in lighting. Now, one of these will show up. Make sure on the bottom it says window, rendering, and lighting. Now, something something like this will pop up. You just want to drag this into your, to your inspector tabs over here. And you want to click on over here. You just want to put it on whatever these settings say. I don't know. I, I forgot. Um... <laughs> Just copy these. Also, uh, let me just. This is baked lighting, which uh looks the best. So uh, shadow mask, shadow mask, blah, 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 advanced radius, blah, all of this. You just keep it like this, high quality. Okay, so right here it'll say generate lighting. Just click it. It'll take a long time. I'm, that's why I'm not gonna do it because I've already done it. I don't wanna sit here for about like. I don't know, I forgot how much time, but I'm not going to sit here for that long. So, uh, on, when it downloads, it should be like that. Uh, if it's dark, uh, just set it back to real time. Because sometimes when it's like uh, dark, it means your lighting is in baked. Uh, so, I recommend using real time and uh, very high resolution on your resolutions here. <coughs> You put it on use color settings, the spiky thingies show up, I'm pretty sure. But I'm not sure. I, I completely forgot about it. Uh so you just wanna put it on high very high quality, it'll look better. So yeah. That is how you make realistic lighting in your Girls Hack Fan game. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye.